What is up everyone this is Ken here welcome back to Tech Girl new YouTube channel for user of Poco X3 I'm back with a live back with after a lot of time for making custom room review on Poco X3 I was using I was testing a lot of custom rooms unfortunately all those custom rooms are having with OSS vendor if you don't know OSS vendor has a lot of issues especially scrolling which scrolling issues which I got to know but now we have a custom room without scrolling issues this is a MIUI vendor based and it comes with the experience project as you can see no scrolling issues also alongside with that the room is actually buttery smooth it is quite good doesn't come with many customization but stable enough to use as a daily driver so one of the most try thing on your device how to install this as of course you simply need to install this build on your recovery and you're good to go in the bed in this section where we have installed this first of all let me just move on to the default launcher this is not the default launcher by the way it is called launcher and launcher why it is installed there i have a magisk module available on launcher you can install a custom launcher on your device which is launcher and we have installed it on our device and how to install this link for that thing is in the description let me show you by going into magisk also that what is the safety net status as you can see safety net status is passing what i was saying you that you need you definitely need to try out this experience build on your device because it it comes with a lot of things doesn't come with many kind of customizations by the way but the things which are included are quite stable so you need stability you need good kind of performance based custom room then this might be a very good choice for you if you move on to the security tab you have the face unlock fingerprint options available for you but unfortunately you don't get the app locker which is a little bit downgrade for some of the users but if you don't use app locker then you're good to go but if you use app locker you still have some systemless app lockers available I'll try to make sure to make you give you the video for that one too but I don't have till now but I will definitely provide you and the display section if you move on here you have the option of choosing this icon manager it, this icons which icon you want in your status bar which icon you don't want in your status bar it's just up to you we have all these options available for you NFC etc etc you can also customize the screen of animation which is a very good feature how this is working as you can see when I turned off my screen it was as CRT effect like this this is the CRT animation alongside with that you can also customize the refresh rate to 90 Hertz or 120 Hertz 90 Hertz is good enough I didn't got any kind of scrolling issues lag so it's quite good including that we also have some custom header customizations for example the quick settings customizations available for you where you can customize the header images from da from static to dynamic like this this is how it is working like as I previously mentioned, you want the best ever custom rooms out there. I have other custom rooms also. I will try to make sure to give you the review for all those two. But right now, the experience project is quite good. Let's just move on to some other things. For example, in sound settings, we have the option of Me Sound Enhancer, which is a very good feature. You can simply customize your device audio. And now, let's move on to some other things. For example, battery, etc. Also, I have applied a substratum theme here. You can see this option of choosing the battery icon icons if you want in inside the icon next to the icon or if you don't want the battery icon actually i didn't found this option anywhere i was looking for this in status bar settings or anywhere it was not available but when i opened the battery options the option was visible there so there might be some other hidden features available too i'm not sure but there might be but yes as i previously mentioned you know the most try os on your device if you move on to the system settings as you can see these icons are changed everywhere if you don't know these settings icons are changed everywhere this is not by default i try to apply the substratum theme that was working fine if you want to know what is the substratum theme and how to apply these substratum themes you can simply comment below i'll try to make sure to give you another video on substratum themes very soon and yes these are the things i just wanted to let you know you can also apply some custom icon packs even the option was available in the default launcher i have applied the custom one but in the default launcher the option is present for you now moving on to the camera section this is the default camera which you get here but yes you can use the gcam on your device also if you want to i'm using the gcam 8.1 and this gcam which i'm using on my device link is in the description or you can find out in my channel this is all from today's short and simple video link for this build is also in the description thanks for watching don't forget to like and share this video goodbye
like I'm floating through the air 